My best friend told me her children only watch my vlogs to see the dogs. Would you like to play with a toy? Yep. She said I should make more dog videos. So here's what it's really like living with two Belgian Groene dolls. Okay. Okay. Let me introduce them properly. We got Raven in 2019, she's just turned four. And we got Rasta in 2020, just before lockdown, and he's now three. They share the same parents, mom, Cara, a Grunendal, and dad, Bailey, a Belgian Tafuren. Grunendals are one of the four varieties of Belgian shepherds and are also known as Belgian sheepdogs. They are intelligent, energetic, working dogs, and there's a lot of factual videos about them, but here are 10 things you need to know about living with Belgian Grunendals. Number one. They are herding dogs by nature and tend to instinctively herd you and sometimes nip. They both know not to do this to people, but Raven will nip me if she wants something and Rasta will often just jab his jaws into your backside at times. Number two, they have high prey drives. Raven and Rasta are great around small children, but not small dogs or other small creatures. This is probably why their favorite activity is chasing a toy. They are fine around our cats because they've been raised with them since puppies, and Rasta and Thor seem to have quite a special friendship. Number three, they are very protective of their humans. I've heard it said that these dogs don't bark much, but that is not true. They bark a lot. Okay, okay, okay. They are quite wary of strangers, and Raven will bark if she doesn't trust you, while Rasta will just bark at anything. Number four, they are highly intelligent dogs and very easy to train. They enjoy mental challenges and learning new things. But they can also be a bit stubborn as they always want to be in charge. Number five, they are very energetic and need a lot of exercise. They enjoy games with their toys. We are lucky to have a park two minutes away from our house that is safe and fenced off so they can play off leash, which they love. I'm gonna be free. Stay. Go. I take them separately if I go alone. Okay, come. Yes! Turn around. Ice catch. Oh. They also love going on runs, which I'm sure is quite entertaining for people to see a tiny lady being pulled by two black wolves. Number six, they can also be pretty chilled dogs. I've heard it said that they will do as much or as little as you want them to do. And if they've had their exercise and are all tied out, they will just sleep a lot. Number seven, they are human dogs and need to be around their people at all times. They do not like to be left alone. I'm going to leave you now for a moment. I'll be right back. I know you don't like that, but I will be home soon. Is that okay? Is that okay? No. 
I'll be home soon, boy. Which brings me to number eight. They have no idea of personal space boundaries. They believe they are equal, if not superior, to humans, and they feel they need to be a part of whatever you are doing. They never leave you alone. Number nine. These beautiful coats are double thick layers and they shed like crazy. They need to be groomed quite often. They get brushed every second day normally, but every day in autumn and spring when they lose their summer and winter coats. This is not a Belgian fact, but an all dogs fact. They are the best companions. They ask so little, yet give endless unconditional love in return. When my friend Laura once told me, get a dog, you won't regret it. This was true, but having two is even better. They are such a special part of our family and we couldn't imagine life without them. If you like this video and you want to see more dog content, let me know your ideas in the comments below. And if you're new here and want to see more of Raven and Rasta, please consider subscribing as they feature in many of the vlogs on this channel. I hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time.